Hey everybody, it's me Turtle. I'm going to be reviewing my CDST boots. I got CDST Air boots. Uh, the air boots means that they are perforated, so I get a lot more airflow. Of course, you know, rain protection, all that crap isn't going to be the best, but I don't ride in the rain. Um, I mean, I've been caught in the rain before, but I don't go out of my way to ride in the rain. They are great. I thought they would be very rigid, kind of like ski boots, but they aren't. They're rigid in a couple directions, I guess, or a couple, a couple axes. Uh, the first axis in which they are rigid is this way. Like, you can't roll your ankle. The next way in which they are rigid is this way. So if this was my foot, my fingers or my toes, I can't bend them down, but I can bend them up. Which is really helpful when it comes to shifting, but also awesome so I don't rip my toes off in the event of an accident. They have toe sliders. They have, again, like this, like a skeleton framework that comes up the side and helps protect your leg. On the front of the boot, there is a big piece of plastic, and that piece of plastic helps protect from the foot peg, because when you crash, I guess, your foot comes off the foot peg and usually gets obliterated by said foot peg, unless you're wearing that kind of protection up high. The CDSTs, I believe, are almost top of the line. I think there's either a step or two steps above. I know the Vortice or Vertice are above the STs, but again, for the riding that I do, they are absolutely more than enough. The ST airs, they really mean it when they say air. Like I can feel air coming into my boots, wrapping around my toes, and it, my feet are just nice and cool. They're not sweating at all. <laughs> they really put a lot of time and I guess engineering into these boots, and I, I can't recommend them highly enough. This is my CDST Air boot. This is just the left boot. You can already see that it's getting some wear points here from moving, rubbing up against my rear sets, but that's okay. They look very hot, but they are not hot. Uh, they do a great job ventilating with the perforation that's on them, as well as this massive vent right here. I thought this was kind of like a gimmick, but it really does work. I could feel, like I mentioned in the video, I can feel the wind coming along like the outside of my foot and just kind of circulating like all inside. I can actually feel it all the way up towards the toes. They are really easy to get on and off because they are not as crazy as the Vertice. Um, they only have one buckle up top here on this side and on this side. Here is the skeleton structure along the left side of the boot. It kind of wraps around the back here to this side, but there is nothing here. And here is the protection on the shin to protect your shin from being destroyed by your foot bag. As I mentioned in the video too, um, there are certain ways that this boot can bend and ways that the boot cannot bend. It can bend this way. You can see that here in the, the ankle, which is helpful for shifting. It has a shift protector as well. It cannot bend this way. Also, I was mentioning that it can't bend this way. I believe there's a piece of reinforcement that goes here along the sole of the boot. But it will bend this way, but not this way. To get them on and off, it just has these two clips up here. The zipper is on the inside. Piece of Velcro. They zip down. You slide your foot in, zip it back up. Velcro it, slide these up, put underneath the front protector, clip, clip, and you're ready to go. Easy on, easy off, great protection. Highly recommended. CDST Airs.